Hi, I'm Dr. Tony Beninato, and I'm an endocrine surgeon here at Rutgers Cancer Institute and an associate professor of surgery at Robert Wood Johnson Medical School. Radiofrequency ablation is a minimally invasive office-based procedure uh, that involves using a needle to deliver energy to benign thyroid nodules to slowly dissolve them over time. Patients who have benign thyroid nodules that are causing symptoms, such as difficulty swallowing uh, or pressure or fullness in the neck, may be a good candidate for radiofrequency ablation instead of traditional surgery. Um, surgery is the most complete option for a thyroid nodule as it completely removes the nodule. However, it has the downsides of general anesthesia, a scar on the neck, and some downtime after the procedure. Uh, radiofrequency ablation, um, in contrast, will decrease the size of the nodule over time, but does not completely eliminate the nodule. However, um, it's a same-day procedure, there's no general anesthesia uh, and no scar. Patients have the added benefit of usually not requiring thyroid hormone after radiofrequency ablation, which is something commonly needed after thyroid surgery. During the procedure, the patient lies flat on the table in the office uh, and is covered with clean sterile drapes. Then a needle is inserted into the nodule and energy is delivered over several minutes. Um, at the end of the procedure, the patient is observed for about 20 minutes to a half an hour and then is able to go on with the rest of their day. Following radiofrequency ablation, we will monitor the decrease in the size of the nodule over several months uh, with interval ultrasounds and also laboratory tests to make sure the thyroid is functioning properly.